Hi everyone, I hope you enjoyed the interview and learning more about the TLU Orchestra and our partnership with the Mid-Texas Symphony. As you heard in the interview, we've had to make many accommodations in order to keep everybody safe during this global pandemic. And that means that this is only some of our, our string students and only some of the music that we've been preparing this semester. So I want to invite you to like the TLU School of Music or TLU Orchestra and Alumni on Facebook for further updates about performances and opportunities to hear from our students. Now please enjoy this musical message. My name is Camille Green. I'm a fifth year senior from Dallas, Texas. I'm majoring in biochemistry and I'm a violinist in the TLU Orchestra. A Romantic era composer, Giovanni Bottasini, was a conductor and double bass virtuoso. His exceptional skills as a bassist are reflected in his compositions and his well-known works for solo bass. The Grand Duo was originally written for two double basses. Shortly after its premiere, one solo part was transcribed for violin. This violin-based instrumentation quickly became the standard arrangement for performances past and present. Meet our soloists, violinists Hannah Grove and bassist Kevin Borkfeld. Please enjoy Grand Duo Concertante for Violin, Double Bass, and String Orchestra by Giovanni Bottasini. Hi, my name is Hannah. I am a senior here at TLU, majoring in theology pre-seminary with a minor in Greek and in music. And I'm from Omaha, Nebraska. I um, auditioned for the Mid-Texas Symphony in February of last year. Um, unfortunately, I have not gotten the chance to perform with Mid-Texas Symphony yet because of COVID, but even just the audition experience was um, a great learning opportunity for me. Um, I got to hear other people's opinions of my playing and what things I should be doing better in a professional setting rather than just in an educational one. Hi, my name is Kevin Borkfeld and I am a senior music performance and education major at Texas Lutheran University. I'm originally from Round Rock, Texas and I've been playing with the Mid-Texas Symphony for about two years now. Um, it has been a very wonderful experience for me to play with the Mid-Texas Symphony because they provided me with so many opportunities to learn and uh, really grow as a musician. Um, to be around so many professional musicians really pushes me um, to play my best and learn everything that I can from rehearsals and concerts and everything in between. Um, so thank you Mid-Texas Symphony for all the experiences and I can't wait to learn and play more with you.
Gray, and I am a senior at Texas Lutheran University. I'm an integrated science and psychology major, and I'm from San Antonio, Texas. Though written for lute, Concerto in D Major RV 93 by Antonio Vivaldi is most commonly performed on the guitar or occasionally the mandolin. In the Ritornello form characteristic of the Baroque period, this arrangement for two violins, partly transcribed for viola by Dr. Jeffords, preserves the energetic interchange between the orchestra and the soloist accompanied by the basso continuo, cello, and harpsichord. Meet our soloist, Marley Dugan, on violin, and Jaylee Ann Cummings on viola, and then please enjoy Vivaldi's Concerto in D Major. Hi, I'm Marley Dugan. I'm a senior music education major at Texas Lutheran University, and this year will be my third year performing with the Mid-Texas Orchestra. I'm so grateful to have the opportunity to play large-scale orchestral works with amazing musicians in my community. Hi, my name is Jaylee Ann Cummings, and I'm a junior at Texas Lutheran University, majoring in viola performance and music education. I'm originally from Universal City, Texas. The Mid-Texas Symphony has helped me to make connections with other musicians, and it's helped me to perform music that will prepare me for my future and has made me an overall better musician. competition, Dvorak String Quartet No. 2 is scored for two violins, viola, cello, and double bass. Bearing the motto of the competition, For My Nation, the quintet won first prize and was also a part of Dvorak's portfolio for a state scholarship to further his focus on composition. The addition of the bass to the traditional string quartet instrumentation adds a rich depth to the texture, as well as making it possible for the cello to sing out in its higher range throughout the work. Please enjoy the first movement of Dvorak String Quartet No. 2, Allegro con fuoco. <laughs> 